Hey there, this is David from Time Out New York. Here are the five best things to do this weekend. I'm talking to you from fabulous One World Observatory where I'm overlooking all of Manhattan. And you can have this view too. Through Sunday, February 11th, One World Observatory is offering two for one prices so you can bring your boo or your side piece and come check out this view. Or if you're violently single like I am, you can just come alone. It's all good. Friday night at Lot 45 in Bushwick, it's one of my favorite events in town, Lust's Valentine's Day Dinner. This is an over-the-top debaucherous feast at which you can dine off of naked bodies. There's fire dancers, aerial performers, all kinds of wild stuff. Valentine's Day is not the only auspicious date this week. It's also the start of the Chinese Year of the Dog. At 11 a.m. on Saturday, head to Madison Avenue and East 76th Street for the Lunar New Year celebration. There's gonna be lion dancers, paper dragons, all the way down Madison Avenue. Serve 50 Shades of Grey realness in a mask, dress, and tux at the Dances of Vice Venetian Valentine Grand Masquerade Ball at Capital. There's gonna be opera singers, burlesque dancers, all kinds of crazy BDSM, kinky, kinky, crazy stuff happening. Liberate yourself from old school social norms and learn something new this weekend by hearing about some of the unsung artists and heroines of contemporary, modern, and historical art at Shady Ladies Tours of the Metropolitan Museum. What would Valentine's Day weekend in New York be without the bracing Cupid's Undie Run? Head to Stage 48 on Saturday at noon for this dance party slash run, all for good causes. You can strip down to your underwear or your long johns and party all day. I'm 102 floors up, so I am taking the elevator. <laughs> Can do that again. <laughs>